what they look like done. But that's me, that's me right there. All right, if y'all got some time, I'm gonna show you how we took these four TVs and made one big screen. Luckily, as soon as we walked in the house, boom, it was the first room right there. Let's get some studs first with the stud buddies. Now we need three holes here, giggity. So I'm gonna take the fish tape, run it up, we good to go. Now we're gonna cut out all three of these holes. Now that we got that taken care of, I'm gonna use this magnet pool, super strong magnet, roll all the way down to the bottom. I'm gonna go ahead and do the outlet now. I feel like it makes the process a little easier. Then we're gonna put all the HDMIs on that little clip that I added and then tape everything together, protect the ends of those HDMIs. Some people are gonna be like, use a fish tape, and I'll probably be like, just use some mouthwash and back up. Criticism be crazy, because I'm like, I, I never asked you for how you do it. I ain't asked you nothing. I don't even know you exist. You here on my video. All right, we're gonna take the Romex through, finish that plate on the right side, and then finish the outlet up. Now, I should have put something down there to protect that floor, but sometimes I'd be so excited, I'd just be ready to get started with the job. Anyway, let's move on. We're gonna get a measurement on where that TV's going. I'm gonna mark that down, and then we're gonna push these together, and I'm gonna get a distance on the top to the bottom amount i like to write my measurements down add another stub buddy and then i'm gonna put the tape measure at the top of the tape i need to be 12 and a half inches below that then we're gonna mark each pilot hole i'm gonna do the top half first then we're gonna get the ledger level set it up 26 and a half inches below and then do the pilot holes on the bottom too here i'm going with a three eighths bit just to give me some pilot holes exactly in line and then we'll throw the mount up there and then we'll move on to the, oh damn yeah that wasn't a stub boss players mess up it's all good we just gonna blame johnny <laughs> when in doubt blame johnny all right once we get those first two up there i didn't mind the way they were sitting so now we're gonna move on and drill in the pilot holes on the left side after we get that mount up there we can oh damn i missed again i ain't seen this much missing since i got the amber alert okay let me chill out let me chill out i forgot what Derek did but the boy had to pay the price now that we got all four, I mean all four of them up there, I want to give y'all a close up just to show you kind of what it looks like. So I like to start by taking the top two off and then fixing the bottom two and making those even. So we'll adjust the vertical adjust on those two. And you'll see when I drill it, giggity, it'll make that one pop up a little bit. And then um, I want to plug everything up first and then we'll finalize the bottom two, add the top one back. Because I lifted it up, I got to lift that top one up a little bit. So we did that, plug everything in, add the last one. And then now I'll make some more adjustments to that one as well. I'm not even going to front. I edited the hell out of this. It was a lot more adjustments needed than just that part right there. But y'all get the gist of it. The last part, that top right one's a little too forward. So we want to get that even with the one on the left side. And this is the moment right here where I knew we was cooking with grease. They say, how come past the guy have a nice car? I said, don't ask no questions all right i'm sorry let's get back to the video all right we got that in there process is coming in next now i'm gonna pull all the pieces of plastic off. this is the best part right here so therapeutic each tv has its own hdmi we're gonna hook that up to the processor and then there's inputs on the processor but we got to flip the images because the top two tvs are upside down so if you watch closely you'll see them all flip then after that we'll make it one big screen and then I typically go to YouTube to test it out, see how everything looks. Now, this ain't for everybody. Most people that get this want to see four things at one time. Some people, oh, I couldn't do the lines, my OCD. Nobody motherfucking hurts you about your OCD. You just came here to complain. Oh, which is weird because it's like anything I don't like, I would never spend time complaining about. Look, look at that from the side. That's perfection right there. I'm telling you, you got to give us a call. We're going to do a good job. I promise we can provide all the equipment, all the details. You just let me know. And you want to get that long? Um, um, yeah, <laughs> 